Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can integrate Microsoft Outlook with the Zapier. First things first, we have to create ourselves an account at, uh, at Microsoft Outlook or login to your existing account. As you can see, uh, you just can switch between all the Microsoft products, but you can't actually make the integration straight away through Outlook. So what we uh, are going to do, we are going to use Zapier as our third party application for finishing our or creating our integrations. We can also use like automate.io. We will leave, uh, you will find the link in the description or Zapier, but let's focus on Zapier now. Once we are here, we have to create ourselves an account at zapier.com. And once we do that, uh, we have to go to the top left corner and click on this uh, black button uh, with make a zap inside. Zap stands for integration. Once we click there, uh, we can name our zap like Outlook to for well, then, like, I don't know. Let's go with a Trello, for example as a, a integration that as an application that is going to be the second to integrate and now we have to start with a trigger so the first trigger or the trigger application will be outlook we find in the search engine microsoft outlook and we click uh, and choose the microsoft outlook now we have to go with the trigger event this event will show you or will be the starter uh, of this integration. So if something happened in Microsoft Outlook, it will trigger event in, uh, in Trello. Uh, at the moment, Zapier is providing us with uh, I mean, it's five options, like new email, new contact, and so on. So let's go with the second one, new contact. We hit continue. Now we have to log in to the account that we created at Outlook or the one that we already have. We click there, we hit continue. Now we have to set up a trigger. Uh, there will be uh, a contact folder like in, or a group in your uh, Microsoft Outlook. So after you choose one, you hit continue and you will test the trigger. On the second action will be actually Trello like this we choose Trello as the application affected by uh, Outlook we choose an event <laughs> let's go with create a card so if the new contact appear in Microsoft Outlook it will create a card in Trello we hit continue and the last thing that we have to do we have to uh, log in to the to our Trello account and that's about it so yeah Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.